Sean has just rescued a frog that he found croaking for help in his garden. He's thrilled and is already on his way to making a cozy little home for his new pet. Sean begins by putting in the layer of sand and gravel in the bottom of a fish tank. He then adds a handful of soil and little plants from his garden to give the frog some breathing space. Colorful rocks and tiny caves are also placed inside to make the frog feel at home. It's time for the cuddly critter to leap in. What did Sean use to make the frog's home? He used a mix of sand, gravel, plants, soil, and other pretty little things to build the frog its home. The different things that Sean put together to make his pet's home can be called a mixture. What is a mixture? Mixtures are formed when two or more substances are mixed together without creating a new substance. This bowl of fruits is also a mixture because it has two or more types of fruits that have been mixed together. A bowl with only green grapes is not a mixture. Mixtures need to be more interesting than that. They need to have more stuff in them. How would you separate the fruits in this bowl? The fruits in this bowl can be easily separated. You could use your hand or a simple tool like a spoon. But how would you tell one fruit apart from the other? You can tell them apart by paying attention to their physical properties. Color, shape, size, taste, scent, state, and texture are some of the physical properties that can help you. Sean can separate the orange and pear from the other fruits, even with his eyes closed. Which properties of the fruits could he use to help him? He can use shape. The pear is of a different shape from the other fruits. Sean separates the orange by feeling its bumpy texture. The skins of the remaining fruits have smooth textures, easy as pie. It's simple to separate mixtures because each substance in a mixture retains most of its physical properties. An apple remains an apple, and a pear remains a pear. No new substances are formed. We learned that mixtures are formed when two or more substances are mixed together without creating a new substance. Each substance in a mixture retains most of its physical properties. These properties can help us separate them from the mixture. Which of these are mixtures?